Welcome to Using Zoom for the First Time. We'll discuss opening the file, logging in for the first time, and then finding it again once you've saved it. I'm Trainer Lori. What is Zoom? It's a free program where you can meet virtually with others without having to be there in person, even though you really want to be there in person. It's great for from 2 to 100 users. And for the free account, you can meet for 40 minutes or less. At the end of 40 minutes, it will shut off, but you can always start it up again. And the best part is, is you can use it with video. You can also do it without video, but here's a tip. Right now, especially when you can't go travel and meet with people, especially grandkids or family, this is a great way to meet with them and really feel like you've had that interaction. This is a really good time to help your grandkids. To find it, in your browser, type in zoom.us. It will take you to the Zoom site where you have several options. You can click the sign up for free button that's right on the home screen, or you can look up in the top right corner and also see sign up, it's free. Just click that because it is free. And you also have the option there to sign in, host a meeting, or join a meeting. So it's a good idea to be able to go back to that zoom.us site. But once you sign in, you don't have to go back. Now, when you click sign up, it's free. You have the option of entering a, a work email address. That's a good option, whether you're working or not. It can just be your email address. But if you look at the bottom, you can sign in with Google or Facebook, and it will remember your settings. So I'm going to demonstrate signing in with Google. Click the sign in with Google and it will say, which account do you want? If you have multiple Google accounts, choose the account, click it, and then it will say, let's create an account. Click that button because it already knows you from Google. You don't have to put in any other information. It will ask you, are you sure you want to open Zoom? And you say, yes, click open Zoom. There it is. It launches. But you don't want to have to go through all that again to find it. So we have two options. One is to click on your Windows button and then look for the hashtag. That hashtag will open up a way to find all of your programs by their first letter. Zoom is the last one. So you click the Z and it takes you right to Zoom. Click it and it will say Start Zoom. So that's a nice option. But I know that some of you aren't going to remember all that. So here's another way. And then you never have to think about it again. And that is once you open Zoom and you sign in before you start doing everything else that you want to do, because you're going to want to be in this all the time, especially if you have family that you want to talk to. Instead, I want you to look at the bottom right corner where the icon appears on the taskbar. And if you hover over it, you'll see that this is indeed Zoom. It's the blue camera. But if you right click on it, that's using your right mouse button, you'll have the option to pin it to that taskbar that it's on right now. That means once I close Zoom, the icon's still there. So now I can click that icon and open Zoom right from that. Thanks for joining us. See you next time.